guys, Robotic Gamer here. Today I'm going to show you how to have the interceptors replaced with another vehicle that, you know, they respawn normally. And, you know, how to replace it with some other vehicle like the um, LSPD Buffalo or the, um, the Crown Vic. And, you know, um, it's pretty simple. It's not that hard. So I'm going to show you guys how to do it. So basically, the first thing you're going to need is have the game running. Um, so you and also have a window mode. Second thing you're gonna need is cheat engine. Um, you can actually um, Google it and just download it. As soon as you download it, it's gonna look like this right here. What you have to do is just press that you know blinking green and red thing right here. It's blinking. So press right there. Then you have to do is open GTA 5. All right. And then what you have to do, then enable hex, and then you have to put the value of what you of what you want. The value of it basically like a description of a of something like a weapon or a vehicle or something else. All right. So to get the value of the code or the code, whatever, um, this will be a form post down below where I'm gonna post down a description of the code, but you're going to need to you know replace and stuff so we're gonna find the interceptor code so interceptors right here also just listed all the type of police cars because it's not very really descriptive so interceptor what you do is um, copy this code right here the rest do not copy don't even copy the zero or the X don't copy that just copy this code right here in the first line copy and then replace it right here then you do is just scan the value or the and here we go it comes with different addresses and stuff like that what you do is press ctrl a and uh, highlight everything and then press the real red mouse here now all the addresses uh, everything here is, is now listed down below and then we're gonna have to do now guys is change this little code right here to other code of other car so basically when it like try to trick the game and let us do the police crown vic and this is the code right here which is the police standard so what you do is control a to highlight everything change the value to this which is the crown vic one all right and we're done and you know, uh, you can like close now the program, anything like you can just, you know, just close it and I'm going to minimize this. All right. And now guys, I'm going to prove to you guys, um, that the crown Vic actually do respawn now. So. All right, I got a star. Here we go. I'm gonna show you guys. Yeah, yeah. You can also do this with like other vehicles too. Like for example, if like if there's the FIB undercover car with the SWAT in it, you can also replace that too. So the other car you're liking. And here we go, the Crown Vic spawn, trying to kill me. Oh, ow. All right. Here comes more. It's pretty awesome. This is like the first time I feel like Crown Vic spawning on me. Yeah, trying to kill me, everything. Headshot. It's pretty cool. You feel like this is actually now an LAPD chase. It doesn't even feel like an LAPD chase with those interceptors at all. This feels like an LAPD chase right now. They're like in those uh, news, uh, like in those shows or those, pol those police chases on the TV.
die. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Whoa! What was that? Alright guys, so that was my little proof of the Crown Vic that she spawned. Um, I suggest you don't do this online because, I'm going to tell you right now guys, this actually does work online. So do not try this online because you might get banned. Um, and I mean, yeah, enjoy. You know, you can have like other police cars spawn for you or even the rare buffalo if you want. You know, just look at all the codes. And yeah, that's it. And I hope you guys enjoy. Bye.